Hey guys. So today was interesting. I did my morning routine, which is pretty much get up, breakfast, yoga, shower. Then I went to my group therapy and that was good at the start, but I got quite easily triggered in the group and had to excuse myself because I was getting visual flashbacks of some childhood trauma that I haven't fully dealt with but after that I called my mum and had a good chat to my friend about said trauma and um, in a way I guess it's kind of helped me start dealing with it a little bit so as shitty as it felt to have those flashbacks PTSD style it's almost pushed me to start talking about it rather than keeping it secret and carrying it on my own and I found that I guess my expectations of talking about it were that I would upset people by saying it but if anything I feel more supported so it's definitely something I'll be talking to my psych about tomorrow when I see him because it's definitely something I haven't really delved into in detail but in a way it's good so slowly working through all these little pieces of the puzzle that make up my life story <laughs> of trauma <laughs> it's not all trauma mum and dad are really supportive so I'm really lucky to have them well I spoke to mum about it and she was not upset she was so understanding and think anybody that is dealing with any stuff like that that they're carrying and feeling that way like like it's going to upset someone by saying what happened even though it's definitely not your fault I think that that's a good thing to do so yeah opening up about it definitely helped and because yeah can only go forward now hey guys just a little update after yesterday because I mentioned how triggered I was and how I was getting PTSD flashbacks so far I haven't had any I did have a little one this morning but I did speak to my doctor about some techniques to distance myself from the flashbacks so when I get them, I have a plan. And I've done a little bit of art today. It's just drying. And I'm still making lots of nano blocks as a, another way to keep myself busy. It's something that's super fun and stress-free so far. I've got all of these ones done. So you can see I've got Jolteon, Eevee, Flareon, Vaporeon, Charmander, Bulbasaur, um, and I've got <clears throat> right on the end one that I made out of spares that's a very confused evolution. She's rainbow. And then I've got um, almost all of the Sonic collection here. So Amy, Sonic, Knuckles, Eggman and Tails and then I should be getting a shadow one to do and then that's the whole collection thanks to my sister's partner Pix 
for picking it up from the Gold Coast because it was the only place that had one left. But yeah, that's my collection of little ones. And then I've got some bigger ones over here that I've done. Brown Bear, Pink Hedgehog, Doraemon and Luna. And then I've got a giant Totoro to do. And I'm working on Caterpie as well. So apart from that, I've just been playing lots of games and trying to make a routine, even though it sounds kind of boring. I've got lots of gaming in my routine, a bit of morning yoga, um, lots of art, but just painting because I've lo I think I've kind of lost my passion and motivation for drawing, um, especially when it comes to working on the iPad. But that should come back soon, hopefully. So far, better day than yesterday. Um, but just taking it easy, one day at a time. Not sure at this point when I'll be getting out, but we're not rushing it this time. I'm just starting to look at things that I'm going to be able to do when I get out to keep myself busy before I go back to work. And yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for all your support. I'll keep you all updated as everything moves along. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe if you want the updates and um, ring the bell for notifications if you're worried about missing any of my videos. I've also been streaming a lot of my nano blocks and gaming and streaming that on Twitch. So if you're interested, it's the same tag as my Instagram and Twitter and TikTok. So it's emo pixie with a double E at the end. Emo pixie. That is all. Much love to everybody out there.